Yo, what is up everyone? Welcome back to a brand new video. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how you can get that iPad resolution on your game loop emulator. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can set up your key mapping too. So this video is going to be help you to play Apex Labs Mobile on your game loop emulator with iPad view. So if this video is helpful, if you like this video, then please do subscribe to our channel and stay with us. That's all about the intro. Let's jump into the main things and I'm going to show you how you can do this. So first of all, what you need to do, you have to open your browser and you have to search in Google iPad resolution. Okay. After search iPad resolution, you will get three options over here. First one is for low end PC. The second one is for mid end PC and last one is for high end PC. After get this resolution, you have to um, minimize this one and you have to press on three dot in game loop emulator and go inside the settings after that engine scroll down and in resolution section you have to scroll down here you will find a customized option over here after go inside open your browser again after open the browser choose whatever you want to put in customized section so if you have low end pc then choose this one median then this one and the high end this one okay i'm going to use this one 2048 into 1536 so i'm going to use this one it's 2048 and 1536 okay i'm gonna put it and save it so after that you will get your ipad resolution now i'm gonna show you how you can set up your key mapping so first i'm gonna tell you one thing if you want to uh, use ipad view on game loop emulator then the problem is you can't use your uh, default key mapping because you, your default key mapping is not going to be work perfectly so you have to be a uh, set up your own key mapping so for set up your own key mapping what should you do you will get a link in the description you have to download this file i i, I think you guys are uh, watching right now um you have to f download this file and you have to extract in your desktop or anywhere you want after that what should you do you have to create a folder in your desktop or anywhere you want you have to create a folder so after that what you will do after that you have to open c drive or d drive you will find a folder called program folder so my program folder inside of uh, my c drive so after open my c drive you have to go inside the program folder after open program folder you will find a folder called tx game assistant you have to go inside the ui folder okay after that you have to be uh, scroll down here after scroll down you will find default key mapping over here here you can see it's a default key mapping you have to copy this one okay you have to copy this one and you have to put inside this folder new folder after put this one i'm gonna uh, put it just in seconds you have to copy this one and you have to paste it over here so after that close it after that you have to change your default key mapping and if you want to change your default key mapping, just copy this one and paste it over here inside of this folder. Okay. And I'm I'm gonna use my key mapping right now. And for this, you have to replace this one, copy and paste it over here. And you have to press continue. And here you can see it's change. Okay, after change, you have to uh start your game loop emulator right now. So I'm going to start my game loop emulator. So here you can see I just start my game, and after start the game, what should you do? You have to open your key mappings after open key mappings here you can see i'm going to open my key mappings right now after open your key mappings you have to press on a reset button over here just press on reset you will get this key mapping on your screen right now so after that just you have to set up your own key mapping i'm gonna set up my key mappings right now to put your uh, file button over here right click over here space button over here after that save it i think i think it's uh, going to work if it's not then we have to put manually one by one okay so i'm i'm gonna i'm gonna try this uh, here you can see my right click is not working so i have to put my right click exec over over here over here in this place okay i have to put my right click over here i have to you have to find your actually your own key mapping you have to put your uh, one by one um for using key mappings okay so here you can see my right click is working perfectly so um I, left click is working perfectly too so here you can see you have to put your f button or e button which one you want you have to put over here so i'm gonna put f i'm gonna put f2 over here one over here you have to find your own actually find your own so here you can see it's running perfectly uh c is working slide is working run fast everything is working perfectly so i have to put my uh, ability button I have to put my ability buttons over here x button for here over here g i don't need alt over here shift i don't i have to put tab over here v over here okay everything is perfect so 
actually um this is the key mapping i think uh, you guys understand everything so if you use this key mapping you have to uh, put ctrl button over here or over here okay you have to put over here okay here you can see everything is working perfectly and uh, my um movement and everything's um my aim stock is not uh, there is no aim stock everything is working perfectly so this is the way to uh, set up your own camping i think you guys understand um and uh, you guys uh, um you can, and now you can play uh, on ipad view and you will get your key mapping too so i think uh, this video has helped you to play episodes mobile on ipad view and this video has helped you to set up your own key mapping on ipad view if this video is help if you like this video then please do subscribe to our channel and see you guys that's all about stay home stay safe bye bye and take care